three fourths times. Let's address this eye makeup. I have been watching a lot of TikTok and they've been doing cool makeup looks and I wanna do cool makeup looks, but I have no makeup skills. Thus, this was born. I figured there's some green on this dress. Also, do you like my housewife dress? Do you like my good housewife dress? I'm baking a chocolate cake. I'm a little sad and baking is my coping mechanism because that's what society told me. Actually, I told myself that when I was a kid, I was like convinced I was gonna be a writer and every single one of my female protagonists, favorite thing to do was bake. Like I watched too many Katherine Heigl movies. I think that's what it was. Okay, so I changed angles because I figured you'd be able to see everything. This is my bowl. We have steel bowls. I wish we had cute aesthetic clear bowls, but my family is clumsy, so it's probably really smart that we have these bowls. Preheat oven to 325. I did that wrong. I sift in coca into a medium bowl and whisk in boiling water until smooth. I'm doubling this recipe because I want to make a layered cake. It calls for half a cup of boiling water, and so I'm gonna do one cup. Nope, that doesn't fit. Cool, cool, cool. Great. Also, this doesn't fit. Okay. My life is a fucking nightmare. Why does cocoa powder like clump like this every single time? This cocoa powder isn't even that old. I bought this a month ago. Now I have to sift it. I have to re-sift it because a bunch of chunks fell through. If I had a small business, I always envisioned myself at the bakery. But like, I'm so bad at baking. Like this is not for me. I think it's because baking is for people who follow instructions. And I am terrible at following instructions. I'm really good at cooking because cooking is like a little this, a little that. I very much am an eyeballer. All right, I'm getting something else because I do not have the patience. Here we go. Boom. Boom. I have to get myself one of those like Danish pastry whisks because like the regular whisk I have is really annoying. Stuff gets like stuck in it all the time because it's a whisk. I honestly prefer to use a fork instead of a whisk. This one cake calls for two bowls. Ugh, that's so annoying. This stresses me out. Let's, let's grab this. My TikTok feed has just girls doing the busset challenge. Oh my God, I sound so like the busset challenge and it's just stuck in my head. Let's pour in some vanilla. Did I just make melted chocolate? I could have just melted some chocolate. I don't know how much vanilla I'm supposed to put but this entire thing. This is what it looks like. Yum. Ugh. I need to get a stand mixer. I don't have a stand mixer. Don't you just hate when you decide to bake and then it requires you to do work? I'm gonna put this here. All right. Oh, cracked that egg on accident. Whoopsie daisy. One. I'm putting in the entire egg, right? Where the hell is the sugar? Okay, three fourths cup. Three fourths times. I have to put in one and a half olive oil. One and a half olive oil. One and a half cups of olive oil. Oh, this is gonna take way too long. There's not one and a half cups of olive oil in here. Now let's open this bad boy up and put in some more. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on. Just a little bit. Let's pour this in. Where's the electric mixer? Ah, uh, mommy now. Okay. Where's the electric mixer? Electric mixer? Yeah. What do you need it? Where's the electric mixer? It should be in the... Uh, it's not in there. Okay, bye, I love you. I 
found it. Here we go. Blast off. Ah. It's so slimy. I know it's gonna taste bad, but I really want to put this chocolate in my mouth. It's so smooth. Oh my, why did I do that? I know it's not the recipe's fault, but this calls for so many bowls, and it's so annoying. It's honestly my fault because I'm the kind of person who will write in a recipe and then I'll be like, ooh, this one looks pretty. And then I'll pick on that. This calls for half a teaspoon of baking soda, but I have baking powder. So you have to use three times the amount of baking powder as you use baking soda. And I'm doubling the recipe. So I would first of all need one teaspoon. Okay. I would need a teaspoon if I was just using baking soda. So then I would do a teaspoon times three, which is three. So I have to do three teaspoons. I really hope I'm right. Two. All right, and how much salt? One teaspoon of salt, that's why I have two teaspoons of salt. I'm going to take this fork and mix this around. Hello. Oh, this is the wrong angle. I put the cakes in the oven and while they were baking I cleaned up and now they're outside cooling and I thought we could make the buttercream together. So this is four cups of powdered sugar. Now I have butter somewhere, I just saw it. Oh, I have this butter. It's cured butter, unsalted from Vermont. Wow, yum. And it's very soft. It smells like butter. I saw packaging and I was like, ooh, I love it. So I obviously mixed the butter and the sugar or crammed it or whatever it's called. And it just ended up looking like old milk or chunky milk. And it was so gross. It literally just tasted like butter and sugar. So I tried blending it some more, as you can see here and I'm like pushing in the sides. I'm really trying, but I never could get buttercream right. I don't know why I thought I should do this on video, but I could never get it right. So here is me attempting to mix it some more, thinking that maybe I didn't mix it enough, but that didn't work. And you guys, I tried this recipe not once, not twice, but three times. Second time, I decided to add some milk because I thought maybe it needs some milk to make it more creamy. It just tasted more nasty. I, I don't know how three ingredients can just taste so disgusting, but it was awful. And I went to the store and got more butter because I only had two sticks of butter you saw me use. Oh, look at me. I just like spilled a bunch of milk. I am like on the end. I was like, oh, maybe this baking this cake will make me feel better. And then this buttercream just wanted me to throw myself down a flight of stairs. Yo. I have been through it since you last saw me. Look at my eyes. Fucking my eyeshadow has turned into dark circles. We're powering through. Fucking I made this icing or this frosting not once, not twice, but three times. And each time it failed. I wasted so many sticks of butter, so many things of powdered sugar, like, I don't know why frosting or like buttercream is like the one thing I can't do. So I finally gave up. It's like 1 a.m. and I went to the store and I got this because I'm 
fucking making this cake. I'm depressed and I'm gonna do it. So from what I saw on TikTok, you're supposed to put some in here. Here we go. Crap, now I have to go wash my hands. Ooh, I have a thing for this. I did not have a thing for this, but I do have this knife that's kind of fat. So, here we go. Oh, crap. I didn't put enough frosting in between. That is such good cake, but it needs more frosting. I'm sorry that I'm eating with my hands. I do not want to wash any more dishes. Thank you for watching my slow descent into madness. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.